I'm out here near Fox Creek with MLA Todd Lowen. Thanks for welcoming me to your beautiful constituency, Todd. Yes, thanks for coming, Jason. Appreciate it. It's been uh, been great to see the, some of the oil and gas activity going going on right here. And we're at uh, the Halo Exploration Site um, in the McKinsey Play. This has uh, uh, produced a lot of jobs around here in the past, but it sure has slowed down in, in the last couple of years, eh? Yes, it sure has, but uh, it's exciting to see this happening now, and I think this uh, might be a big step forward because this is kind of a some new technology involved here and everything, and I think it's going to be great to see this before. So, so Todd is by profession an outfitter, and uh, this is a tough year for you guys too because you don't have any tourists coming in uh, from outside the country. Uh, how is how is that affecting the region and, and the industry that you're most familiar with? Right. Well, it's it's devastated actually. It's just like the rest of tourism in Alberta, of course, without having the, uh, the residents or people come in from outside the country, from the U.S. and Europe and things like that. Obviously, there's just absolutely no outfitting business right now and obviously the tourism industry across Alberta is suffering. Well, we are going to be making a policy change so that Canadians can hire outfitters here in Alberta to make up for that. That's been prohibited in the past, but we've been working with you on that and, and, and uh, trying to throw a lifeline. But one thing, one of the things we're doing is in our economic recovery plan, it's about building, diversifying, and creating jobs, building on our strengths. And of course, our greatest strength as a province is our energy sector. Uh, this, in this area, there may be billions of barrels of accessible oil, and we believe oil prices are going to come back. So producers like this, who are getting through this uh, trough, are, I think are leading the way to a more prosperous future. And I know people up in, in this northwest corner of the province, they depend on resources, oil and gas, forestry, mining, and, and obviously agriculture. Exactly. No, it's, it's great to see, and it's great to see uh, a company like Halo taking, uh, taking some risks and going out there, and they, but they've done the research, so they know they got a good thing going, and it's going to be great to see this come to fruition. Awesome. Thanks very much for welcoming me, Todd. Uh, see you back in the legislature, and uh, just another good example of how Albertans are resilient, and we're going to get through this together uh, to recover stronger than ever.